I think it's time for a new feeding video. What do you guys say? Nah, I'm just kidding. So in this bucket or container, whatever, um, we have crickets that have been gut loading for about 24 hours. So what we have here, we have some carrots, we have some weird spinach, we've got celery, we've got bread, we've got dog food, two different kinds of fish food, we have turtle food. These crickets eat more quality food than I do. But anyways, I think it's time to get these crickets into tarantula mounts. Who's gonna be lucky number one? You. So we are gonna start off with my new, <clears throat> I can't speak, Alphonopalma calcodes, the desert or Arizona blonde. And there we go, her first meal with me. Cricket's still struggling, but I'm sorry little guy, you are a goner. Beautiful girl, truly, truly beautiful. No regrets getting her. Yeah, girl, give us some fang action. That's the end of the cricket. This is the Pamphobedius platyoma, the Brazilian pink blue. Hey, cricket, come back here. Where did you go? There you are. Come here. Go and be eaten. Oh my goodness. That was awesome. I think I missed the attack though. Awesome, awesome eaters. The Pamphobedius platyoma. Brazilian pink bloom. There's your cricket juice right there. Now we're all happy. Show us that cricket juice. Come on, don't hide it. There. You see those legs? That's my skeleton tarantula. Already waiting for food. We're gonna give her this adult cricket. Uh, Yeah, she grabbed it as soon as the cricket went in. I don't know if this one will eat because the butt looks like it's in pre-mold. But this is the... Oh wait, what, what, what? I was wrong. She got it. This is the Orphanaca species Marinduk, or as some of you told me, it's pronounced Marinduki. But yeah, there we go. Thought she was in pre-mode. In here is my Heteroscodera maculata, the Togo Starburst baboon. Let's see if she'll come out and take the cricket for us. Oh my good, what? Get down there. I think she's being really defensive. You heard that? Oh no. I thought she got it, damn it. Oh well, looks like this one's not gonna eat for us. She ran all the way to the other end of the enclosure, so guess she doesn't want to eat. Neoholotheli Inse, Trinidad Olive. Woo, beautiful. I'm sorry, little cricket. Orphanacus, wait, is this Orphanacus? Oreotibialis, the Thailand Golden Fringe. Woo. You're going the wrong way, Cricket. Come on, eat for us. Yes, there we go. Here is my Davis Pantalores, the Guatemalan Tiger Rump. Ooh, that was quick. Look, you can see the Cricket breathing. Whoa, check that out. The juice though. Here's my Terinochilus Dugardi, the uh, Fort Hall Baboon. I expected it to like jump here and grab the Cricket, but yeah, I rehoused her into this new enclosure. Quite proud of it. Looks pretty okay. And she utilized the height. So here's my Hapalopa species Columbia. This is the pumpkin patch. This is the tarantula that is my display picture. Whoa. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this is the exact same one. My picture was when she was really tiny. Very, very good eaters. They're awesome. Look at the colorations, really beautiful. My king baboon is ready for a meal. Are you? Yep, you are. It's not focusing. Focus, phone, focus. Okay, now we've got my Brazilian white knee, the Acanthoscuria geniculata. Oh my goodness. Did you get it? No, the cricket went in, what? These guys are very, very, Oh, come on, cricket. Very, very hungry species. As you can see. <laughs> this is like, literally, it's like one of the best species to keep. They are so hungry. Like, they can even eat before molting. These guys are just that insane. Oh, wait, that cricket's coming out. Come on, cricket. You want to die? Yep, since you're coming out, I think you want to die. Go. Woohoohoo! 
And there's another one in there. Come on, girl. Come on, Cricket. You know you want to die. Get out and die. Come here. You're gonna die. <laughs> Rest in peace. Three crickets. Okay, next up, Kilobrachis King Krachan, the Dark Earth Tiger. Oh my gosh. Almost got the tongs there. Here's a Histrocratis Gigas. That's the mold, by the way, it's not dead. And there's the live one. <laughs> Kilobrachis Wahini, Asian fawn. Oh my. <laughs> what just happened? Yeah, let's try that again. What? How can you not be hungry? Brazilian black, Gramostola pulchra, and he just molted. What? It's a female. I thought it was a male. Did you just change your gender? I swear, like the previous, like three molts before, there was no flap. And now, there's clearly a flap. Yeah, this is like the best day ever. I've got a female pulchra. Wow, this is awesome. Since you molted, no feeding for you. Come on. This is going to be a good one as well. I can tell. This is the... Oh, beautiful. Truly beautiful. This is the Nandu Tripappy. Oh my goodness, look at the cricket. It's like... It's not even a cricket anymore. By the way, this is the Nandu Tripappy, the Brazilian giant blonde. This girl killed that cricket instantly. There's another one. Enjoy your second meal, girl. So you can be fat, fat, fat. Look at that. Like, that was literally the cricket. That's crazy. Here's another Acanthoscoria geniculata. This one was a little bit more gentle than the previous one. But you still get more because you're a big girl. There you go. This is the Ceratogyrus marshalli, the Great Horned Baboon. Now look at this enclosure, the way I built it. So. There's like another, like a layer down there. There's like two levels. And I expected her to like use that as like the burrow. And she just sits up here. What the hell, girl? Why don't you just utilize the burrow? Because, oh. Because, aren't you a burrower? I don't know. Let's tongue feed my Lassiodora Klugi just because we can. This is the uh, Bahia Scarlet. So now we're moving on to one of you guys' favorite tarantulas. Yep, that's my Minex. Will you eat for us? Yes, you will. Today, pretty calm, I see. That's a good thing. Big girl. Here is the Kilobrachis Wahini. There's another one. Bon Appetite. There you go. Oh my gosh. Gotta lift this species. I say that for every species, don't I? Kilobrachis andersoni, Burmese mustard. Ah, why did I miss that attack? Let's get another attack. All my tarantulas are very gentle today. Why can't they be gentle when I'm like cleaning their water dish? We need aggression when feeding and gentleness when water changing. You guys gotta get your priorities right. Monocentropus belfori, Socotra Island Blue Baboon. Ooh. Do you wanna eat or do you wanna be defensive? There you go. Such a baby, have to tongue feed. You're a big girl, you're not a baby. Learn to catch your own food. Die, 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 die. Cricket juice is so satisfying, man. A phonopelma simani, Costa Rican zebra. Oh, not my tongs. So you see, I gave this girl much more substrate, and she decided to like push all the substrate under the height. Wow. You're supposed to use your height, not push substrate in your height. Come on. Here's my rose hair. The previous one was a Gramostella rosea. This is the pottery. Got a big butt. Look at that butt. Standing high and proud. Ceratogyrus dorlingi, rare horned baboon. Why do I keep missing attacks in this video? Look at that, look at that, look at that. Oh, 
Nasty. Some brutalness right there, right onto the cricket's neck. The kill zone. Here's the Sarico Pelmaru Brewing Tents. I believe it's the Panama Red Rump. This one, this girl doesn't really seem to like crickets, but every time when I give a Turkestan roach, she just grabs. Oh my gosh. Okay. Who's ready for some fun? Freaking OBT, man. Freaking OBT. Let's go. Who wants to die by the famous OBT? Do you want to like say your prayers or something before something yeah you're not gonna escape by biting the tongs because even if you escape oh that is just so satisfying who wants to be next well you're gonna be next oh it's just food girl gotta calm down so we're getting a happy dance right there and i've had people ask me what a happy dance actually is well of course it's not a tarantula dancing because it's got food it's actually spinning, well people claim and say that they're actually spinning a little wet mat as you can see down there and then they're covering the prey why does this cricket have green juice? that's not normal I think it's from the celery or something, I don't know but yeah they are spinning the silk to keep the food clean well that's what people claim they're doing anyways but it makes sense and that cricket with the green juice you can tell that this one is really gut loaded with all the vegetables, so that's good. Why is this girl so fat? I don't feed her a lot. I feed her once a month, and sometimes I don't even feed her once a month, and she doesn't seem to lose weight. So fat, or as how many of you guys like to say, thick. I'm just gonna see if you will eat a small one. I mean, are you serious? You're freaking fat. You're so fat and you're still eating? You gotta learn how to control your own body. I swear, this girl, even after she molts, she's still fat. I mean, look at her, she can't even climb the glass. Here's another OBT. Let's get you guys close up to the... Oh man! Let's do this. Hello. This is probably a bad idea, but... Hello. Oh my goodness, she's coming. Okay, here goes. Oh my! Look at her. She's so angry. She's so angry at me. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't be angry. Don't kill me. I'll feed you. Don't kill me, please. Look at you. Why are you gonna be so pissed off? Here, there's food here. Oh no, you don't come out. Here, there's food. Here you go. <laughs> what are you doing? There's a cricket. There you go. Say thank you freaking OBT guys always with attitude problem here you want another one to make up for it here is my cobalt blue are you going to eat the cricket or just let it sit under you uh, that was uh, the gentlest attack from a cobalt blue I've ever seen Histrocrates gigas Cameroon red baboon and there we go Okay, so here's my Singapore Blue, the Lampro Pelma. Hey, where are you going? Come on, girl. Come get your crickets. Here's the Tapinikinis Gigas, the Orange Chevron. There we go. Brazilian Whitney, Canterbury Geniculata. Awesome. Okay, this one's gonna be a good shot, I can tell. This is my Samopoyas Cambridge, the uh, Trinidad Chevron. There we go. Here's my big female Nandu Chromatus. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a size comparison with my hand. Whoa! Wow! That was the quickest attack I've seen from this one. This is my Caribana Versicolor, the Antilles Pink Toe. Man, these guys can be really, really fast. Here's the Avicularia Species Ecuador, the Ecuadorian Pink Toe. Green Bottle Blue, Chromatopelma 
semi-pubescence. Gave her like four crickets because she is a little bit on the skinny side. Here's my big Lassidora Parahibana, the Brazilian salmon pink bird eater. There we go. Since she's big, I'm gonna give her a couple more crickets. Yep, I think three should be enough for now. Yep, you can tell she's happy. Okay, we've got my cobalt blue in there. There we go. Here's a little Serato Gyrus Marshali. <laughs> little great horned baboon. Ho! Oh, uh, that's the Serato Gyrus Meridionalis. The Zimbabwe Grey Baboon. This is the Thritsopelma Prurians. Whoa! That's crazy! But damn, little guy with big dreams. Gramastola Eherini, the Entrerios. Let's drop this cricket on its head and see what happens. Oh my goodness, what the hell? <laughs> He's probably like, what the hell was that? All right, here's a salmon pink bird eater. Oh my goodness, the Lassiodora Parahibana. I think we missed the attack, but we saw it did a somersault, which is pretty damn cool. Here's another one. Please do a somersault for us. No, I said somersault, not bolt. Come on, go back in. <sighs> no food for you. That will be it for the spiders. Now we're gonna give a quick shout out to our latest patrons. We have. Martin Andrews Jack, Charlie Chavez, I'm, I'm not sure if I pronounced that correctly, if I didn't, I'm sorry, Mr. Dank, as well as 2018 Audi R8, yep, that's my dream car for sure. So once again, thank you guys so much for all of your support, it means the world to me. At the end of the day, I'm making these videos for you guys, and if you guys are enjoying it, I'm enjoying it as well. Well, I'm already enjoying it, like with these amazing animals what's there not to enjoy but i'm glad i can share what i do with a hundred and ninety thousand other people that is just freaking amazing guys but anyways as always if you like this video be sure to thumbs it up if you didn't you are also free to thumbs it down if you're new to this channel be sure to hit that little red button that subscribe button and hit that little notification bell, which is at the side of it. If you'd like to support me through Patreon, as well as check out my social medias, the Instagram, the Twitter, the Facebook, links all in the description below. So as always, thank you so much for watching guys, and I will see you in the next video.